So, um, so it, it tends to move people along get to the other direction, right? Yeah, that makes sense. Like a primitive, yeah, primitive tool. Like um, I've heard that elk, if they smell something coming, like if they smell, if you're out hunting and they smell your smell come down, oh range, yeah, yeah, they'll be like, okay, I'm yeah, out of here. Anytime the wind changes, you know, like even uh, my little dog Stevie, um, he likes to get up on when we're outside. He likes to get up on like a high perch, what whatever it is, might be like a stack of wood or something. But when the wind changes, he'll just like close his eyes and he'll put his his nose up to it you know what i mean like yeah. it's and maybe that's what he's doing he's, he's seeing if there's any any new smells coming from any other directions you know so uh but yeah i mean wildlife are really sensitive to that yeah big know? time yeah some um some leaves or some trees will change the taste of their their leaves oh yeah and really? I, I i think even the odor I might be wrong about that the odor part but yeah if um if all their leaves are getting eaten, mm. they'll change the the uh, flavor to something less wow. desirable. Yeah, man, trees. Uh, like the more we figure out about trees, the more we find out about trees. It seems like uh, that there's like some intelligence to them. You know. Yeah.